hello guys and welcome back to epic mentorship in today's video we are going to look at how to edit an already published video on youtube so if you have published your youtube video and you later notice that you have some sensitive information that you don't want to show it to the crowd or to the public you can easily edit it or you can cut and remove some part of it so that your video can stay safe so it's not the end of the world after you published your video you can easily recall it and try to edit some part you can remove some part you can cut you can even blow some part so that it's not visible to viewers so to start with you need to go to your youtube channel for example here i am on my channel and you can come all the way down to this icon and you can click on it you can go to your youtube studio once you are on your studio you can just come straight away to the content once you're on your content you can select an already published video that you have published already so let's say we just check any video that you have published let's say this one and once you select it you are free to come over to the left here to the editor over here and just click on the editor and it's going to bring you down to this video editor this is your video editor on youtube this is an already published video and you have the option to edit it like i said so we can start by uh, for example at the top here you can see the undo and redo option once you are not capable or comfortable with what you have done you can easily undo or redo if you are now later on satisfied and then here you can see the, the timeline uh, the timeline over here and you can see the different kind of things that you have for example the first one you have is your video timeline where you have the video and down here you have the music i have a small background music attached to it and down here you have the blow sign you can add a blow on any kind of point or position in your video and over here you can put in more end screen assuming you don't have an end screen you can add it in the video as well very easily over here you can see the resize option you can make this smaller and bring in the editing platform to be a little bit bigger and you can make it bigger as well to make it bigger so that you can see the video very clearly and down here you can see the zoom zoom in and out of the the platform you can increase the you can increase or zoom out to see the video very clearly within using this to see the clear details can take you to the clearest detail and you can see it for ease of cut and and thereabout and you can reduce it to see the complete video so this is the complete video from beginning to the end and you can zoom at any given point so this is the playhead as you navigate with this you can drag and drop and it will move you accordingly into the video this is the playhead you can easily move around within the video with this so the first uh, editing that you can do on your video is the trim okay once you enable the trim option it is going to give you the option to trim your video from ends from both ends so for example assuming you want to trim you can just click on trim and it gives you the option to you can split the video at this point for example you can cut the video at this point you can just cut and you'll see it has inserted a cut and the, the video is uh, already cut at this point and you can move it to another place and maybe you can cut again so that you can you may decide to remove this part of the video you may decide to remove this part of the video or you can decide to to trim at some point once you come over you can you hover over to one of the ends of the cut you can trim also inwards okay you can also come over here and trim inwards maybe this is the portion that you want you can click on the preview and to bring those two. okay so you can see the you can click on the preview and down here you can play and see how it looks and what and what part you are removing okay so until you are starting this is the this is the place that you want to remove you can just click on here and just click to see the exact place that you are removing so this is the trim and cut and split part so you want to leave only this place that's what it means you want to leave only this place on your video so once you click on this save it's going to prompt you that are you sure you want to change all this you want to cut a video to this small you say oh, yes then it will enable it 
So you can go back to the editing menu and you can clear all. Maybe you don't want to trim that part. And then down here you can play around with the music as well. You can uh, bring in another music in. You can add a track to this. If you have it somewhere, you can easily add. So for example, you click on this. You have a number of tracks that are available also on YouTube that are free of any copyright. You can easily add. You can easily click on add here to add it to your video. You can easily have it or you can duplicate and have more of it inside within the video you can add more tracks depending and you can preview it over here okay you can just uh, preview and and test it too and down here you have the option to edit the sound effect you can this is now at a maximum level you can reduce the sound directly okay so this is how to add an audio into the track an existing track if you don't have an audio you can add it easily and you can blow a part of the video assuming you have some parts that you don't want the public to see you can easily add a blow to it okay so to blow any part of the video you can just come over here and select add blow and you can do face blow or you can do custom blow i usually go for the custom blow and you can see it appearing here so i don't want it to track the object i just want it to be a fixed blow so you can have it at a given point you can you can extend it to the end on the, of the video if you want it to block continuously until the end or you can just uh, schedule the movement you can adjust it to the specific place where you want it to blow for example i just don't want to show my name so i will bring it over here and you can resize it uh, to just block this part and once you play you will see this part is so this part is blurred already so you are free to delete any particular blow or you can take it to any time you have a defined time or you can do it from beginning to the end of the video down here you have the three dots you can revert to the original video at any given point if you want and you can discard changes the same way or you can save once you save it's going to take effect on the main video all right so lastly you have the end screen option so end screen is just a video you will add at the end of your video so that your viewers can easily click through to it to watch the next video so that's how it is but this is how to kind of make a quick edit to your already published video on youtube so ladies and gentlemen if you enjoyed this video remember to hit the like button and make sure to subscribe to stay connected to this channel for more of our very very useful videos i'll see you in my next video bye